Okay, so here you are, day four, all right? So basically there's a couple things you need to understand when we're talking about selling real estate here with the group, all right? Now, the first thing I need you to understand is there are really seven rules of real estate that you need to know, okay? So the first rule is, number one, you wanna write these down, okay? The first is your main job is to find people to buy and sell real estate. That's obvious, okay? But you'd be surprised how many times people forget this. That's your number one job in life, is to find people who wanna buy, find people who wanna sell, and get in the way as often as possible, okay? Get in between there and help these people get this done. You can't have too many prospects, okay? Rule number one, find people who wanna buy and sell real estate. Rule number two, all right? Follow up with them often, okay? You wanna make sure that you follow up with these people as often as possible, all right? The more often, the better. Because remember, it's not their job to call you, all right? And then third, your third job here is to qualify them carefully. You wanna make sure that the people that you're talking to can actually buy or sell real estate. Otherwise, you're just wasting your time, okay? You can't know too much about them. You wanna know everything you can. You want to find out you know, what they qualify for and if they're a buyer. You want to know how much they owe if they're a seller. You want to know what their time frame is if they're wanting to move, to buy, or to sell. you got to know all of these different things. You can't ask too many questions. Number four, go on presentations, okay? Listing and showing presentations. That's number four. Go on listing and, presentation, listing and, and showing presentations, and the more often, the better. Because what happens is, you develop a routine, you develop a, 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 a groove, if you will, of exactly going out on a presentation every day, seeing people, being in the moment, talking to them. After a while, you'll notice that they say the same things over and over again. And after a while, you'll almost get bored with it because they'll say, well, you know, I don't want to lose my house. I don't want to give it away. Guess what? Nobody wants to give it away, but you have the right things to say. That's number four. Number five, you want to close them, okay? They will sign if you make a great presentation, okay? Now, it's really important that you understand that the way that you present yourself, okay, is paramount. You'll notice that I wear a tie, I wear a suit, I wear pants, slacks, you know, all these things all the time because it's a, it's a perception issue, okay? If they're gonna be listing their $264,000 home with you, then they gotta know you know what the hell you're talking about. And if you come in there and you're dressed like a slob, guess what? They're not gonna sign that property over to you, all right? So you have to know what you're talking about. You can't go in looking like a slob, all right? Number six, you have to negotiate with them, all right? That's where we get paid. And the negotiations is really where you wanna spend a lot of time, you know, getting the property priced properly or writing the offer up to where it'll get accepted, you know, doing the binzer the correct way, all of those things play in a factor here that'll help you get paid. And last, start over the next day, okay? Don't live on your past success. Don't expect that today is gonna to be just as good as tomorrow because you just never know, all right? Each day, if you start off with zero and you start having it in your mind that I have no prospects, I have no leads, I have no escrows, and I have no listings or no sales, okay? And for you, right now, that might actually be true, okay? But the fact is, if you start coming into work with that mindset every day, I've got nothing in the pipeline, and if I don't get cracking right now, I'm gonna be poor. That's gonna take you, catapult you, farther than you ever thought before. So I want you for today three, I want you to remember that those are the seven rules. Find people to buy and sell real estate, follow up with them often, qualify them carefully, go on presentations often, close them, negotiate with them, and start over. If you can do that, you will be successful, I guarantee it. Have a great day. Bye-bye.